Look, man, I am, I think I speak for every man on the planet when I say that I've, I've almost purposely, purposefully not watched Kansas City Chiefs game because of this Taylor Swift stuff. I mean, again, the one day out of the week where men have a chance to be men. Just sit back, grab a few beers, get some good food, and sit on the couch and watch football without being annoyed with anything pertaining to the outside world, especially the pop world. And it literally gets dumped right on our laps with this Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey stuff. But it's but is Taylor Swift a good luck charm because they ain't lost since she been there. And outside of maybe the the Jets game was a little eh. But um outside of that, I mean Kelsey, I mean Ke- Travis Kelsey is Travis Kelsey. He, she he definitely didn't need Taylor Swift to play good because he's been playing good ever since he's been in the league, but I don't know, man. I don't know. Is Taylor Swift a good luck charm that I'm telling you now, as a Packers fan, I would love her to come to our games and give us some of that magic, if it's true, because boy, do we need it. But let's get into this, man. Why do they have the split screen up? Okay, so apparently they scored on a screen. I, I have no idea why why they have the double screen up. Oh, that's tough. So it didn't even count. But that was a hell of a screen. Yeah, man, Pacheco. I love him. I mean, he really reminds me of Tyree. Oh! Asante Harmon. Oh, he's saying, okay. I was like, that was definitely Asante Samuel, who's one of my favorite DBs, by the way. Yeah, man, once again, Justin Herbert played his ass off. To lose, I mean, Justin Herbert's a bad boy, man, and Keenan Allen is a bad boy. Has been for a long time. Um, has one of the more impressive beards in the world of sports. But yeah, man, I really want to see Justin Herbert. Just, you know, he he had he's such a great player, man, and such a great quarterback, but. He just comes in, you know, come up, comes up on the short end of the stick, you know, on games like this, and it just sucked because he's such a great player. Kind of not too far off from Phillip Rivers. Kind of gives me like a similar feeling, you know. But yeah, I, I think the Kansas City Chiefs are, are starting to hit their stride. Um, sure, you definitely would love to see them get better weapons, but the coaching of Andy Reid, the magic of Patrick Mahomes, they'll be fine regardless, as they scored on that last drive. Like Herbert, he like look at that six completions to six different receivers. Like that boy get the ball down the field. It's a hell of a run, hell of a play. Here on second and seven, steps back, 
Yeah, man. I don't know where they rank in the greatest quarterback tight end combo, but they up there with the best. They up there. You know, Brady and Gr There it is. There you go. Taylor Swift. Yeah, man. Yeah, Kansas City, same thing. Same as the Eagles. Had a rough start at the beginning of the season with their offense, even though they were winning. I think they finally starting to put it together, and Andy Reid and his brain is just, you know, they, they're starting to hit their strides. That was a great drive by Justin Herbert. Mm. Just can't stop him, bro. Kelsey's going to get open, and Mahomes is going to find him. It's just that simple. Y'all going to stop trying that boy Asante Samuel, boy. Asante is him, man. I love Asante Samuel. That was a great throw by Justin Herbert. He was enraged. Third and sixteen. Huh. Complete Everett. That's a great open field tackle because that definitely I thought he was about to get the first on that. In the own end zone. Bam. Just look how comfortable he is. You know, in your own end zone, so many quarterbacks panic and you know. Just look how comfortable he was back there. It's crazy, bro. I mean, off the back foot, pressure coming in his face, do it half, you know, half turn. I mean, just look at that, bro. Mahomes is insane, bro. Look at this. Look at this. Just look at him, bro. What do you do with this guy? It's, 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 it's crazy, bro. It's really crazy. Look at that, bro. He almost converted that. That's crazy, bro. It's no answers for these dudes, man. None. Good push. One of those crazy red zone Andy Reid plays, and it didn't even work. And they still they made it work. Crazy, bro. I mean, that's another thing about Mahomes. You see all these magical plays, but he'll take the check down. He'll take the check down, no problem. Get the first down. He's just, he, he, he's one of the best, man. And, and this dude right here. I mean, a couple of more Super Bowls, I would take them over Brady and Gronk. Ooh, fumble. Ooh, fumble. I really love the Chargers DBs. I forgot Derwin James was over here. I love, I love their DBs, bro. Yeah, man, the charge is going to be all right. Um, you know, you just got to... <sighs> and, 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 I mean, we knew this going into the season. It was like, it's so many freaking quarterbacks in the AFC. Somebody was going to get the short end of the stick. And people thought it was going to be Lamar. People thought it was going to be, uh, you know... I don't know, but people just didn't think. I don't even know, man. But the AFC, when it comes to quarterbacks, to, to think about it, just think about it. Justin Herbert, we know how talented he is, how great he is. He's two and three. It's crazy. 
that was just a great play by the Kansas City uh, defensive line, getting his hands up. Look at this, bro. He's converting third and 15s with his legs. It's just unstoppable, bro. Got to him that time. Boy Bosa. Oof. Almost. Almost. Yeah, the Chiefs did a pretty good job of containing uh, Keenan Allen. I think he had like 58 yards, something like that. Look at that protection, bro. That's too much time. <laughs> That's too much time, bro. Like, come on, man. Third and nine. Watch this. Third and nine. Third. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, nah, because he knew he should have caught that. That's crazy, bro. He almost converted that. Yeah, Justin. Justin gonna have to get better with that. He that's the like the second or third time. Like, you gotta be mindful of that defensive lineman, man. Get that ball up a little bit. And plays like this, even if you don't score down seven. You know, it's plays like that that really take the, you know, just, just zap all the energy out of a, out of a team. Man. I think the, oh my gosh, I think that really took a lot of uh, a lot of momentum out of the Chargers. That special uh, special teams play. And honestly, that could have been a score. Patrick lobbed it a little, a little too much. Pacheco off the screen. Yeah, man. Ain't that Mahomes' wife? Like she looked like such a groupie next to Taylor Swift, bro. Anyway, let me let me let me stop. We here for football. Mm. Yeah, it was just a rough day, man. But again, I think the Chargers will be fine. Um, I think they'll put together a string of wins, be in the playoff conversation. Um, how far will they go? We'll have to see. I, I don't have them over the Bills, even though they got embarrassed by the Patriots. I don't have them over the Chiefs. <sighs> the way the Ravens looked, I don't know if I have them over the Ravens. Um, but they'll be fine. The Chargers will be fine. Justin Herbert will be fine. Um, you know, it it take it take losses like that to really build character for a team, and I think the Chargers will be fine. Justin Herbert, you know. Got some things to clean up on, but the talent is there. He's great. We all know it. You know, he's just he he's in the same conference as, as Patrick Mahomes. Like it's just you know, Patrick Mahomes when Rogers get back, Aaron Rodgers, Josh Allen, Lamar Jackson, like it's just crazy. It's crazy when you really think about the AFC and the quality of quarterbacks. Like it's just it's insane, but Justin Herbert will find his way, and he'll be fine. For the Chiefs, again, they just have that championship pedigree. And they're beyond the, um, you know, the point of 
needing to win every regular season game and look great and all. They could look terrible all season. And guess what? If you got common sense, you still wouldn't bet against the Chiefs because they have Andy Reid coaching. You have Patrick Mahomes as a quarterback. And you have Travis Kelsey as an offensive option. Nobody in their right mind would ever bet against the Chiefs, bro. I don't care how bad they looked at the beginning of the season. And again, I, I, I think they're starting to clean it up and get their strides. They're going to be fine. They're going to be fine. Um, you know, I think they lose probably two more. But they'll be in the playoffs, more than likely be in the AFC Championship game. And depending on, you know, how the Dolphins look, they might even beat the Dolphins. And look, I said my Super Bowl is the Dolphins and the 49ers, but we'll see. We'll see. You cannot bet against the Chiefs. You cannot do it. And if you do, you're an idiot. Point blank period. But y'all let me know how y'all felt about this game. Let me know how you feel about these two teams, these two quarterbacks. What do you think Justin Herbert needs to work on? Um, do you believe in the Taylor Swift, uh, uh, not curse, um, the Taylor Swift, uh, magic, do y'all think she's really the good luck charm that everybody's saying she is? Are you annoyed with the Taylor Swift stuff in the NFL? Um, you know, just let me know your thoughts, man. (laughs) Um, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate y'all for watching. Until next time. Peace.